Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Michael. Welcome back to IDB. Today, Apple has released iOS 16 developer beta 5. So on my iPhone 13 mini right here, the update was about 1.3 gigs. I took this screenshot when it was downloading. Uh, for some reason, it said iOS 16.0. It didn't say 16.0 developer beta or beta 5. It just said 16.0. I did check the build number in my settings and this is still a beta. Uh, since we are on beta 5 here, I would expect that this is where we really start to see Apple ironing out every single small bug and issue as we are getting pretty close to the final release of iOS 16 in the fall. It's just over a month away. So here on beta 5 and moving forward, uh, this is where I would really expect iOS 16 to start getting stable. But this is actually a pretty big release in terms of new features. So let's go ahead and take a look at everything new in iOS 16 beta 5. So hands down, the biggest new update in iOS 16 beta 5 has to be the option to now see your battery percentage in your battery icon without going into control center. So this works on pretty much every iPhone that has a notch unless it's a mini phone. So I was a little bit disappointed when I installed beta 5 and I wasn't able to see my battery percentage. I guess Apple thinks that this iPhone is just a little bit too small uh, to fit the battery percentage text up there in the top right. But for most other iPhone users, uh, you're now gonna be able to see your battery percentage. So here's what it looks like. You can see uh, the battery icon is a little bit more bold now and it just kind of fills out the text as to what your battery percentage is. Inside settings, you have a new toggle that allows you to turn on battery percentage. Uh, this is just as it was with the home button iPhones like the iPhone 6, 7, and 8. You're able to see your battery percentage. I don't know why it took Apple this long uh, to bring a very simple feature, but I have a feeling when iOS 16 comes out to the public, uh, this is going to be a lot of people's absolute favorite feature. Uh, they're not gonna care about the new wallpaper options, the new lock screen options. Uh, they're just gonna be happy that we can now see the battery percentage in the status bar. Uh, so thank you Apple for finally bringing this. Uh, this is a long time overdue. Another change here in beta 5 is on the now playing screen on the lock screen. So as you can see, the album art looks a little bit smaller. Also, Apple has updated the padding around all of the assets in here. So to my eye, it looks like the text and the artist is a little bit smaller. You can also see we have a completely new visualizer here on the top right, uh, which kind of animates showing you that music is playing. So overall, some nice tweaks to the now playing screen on the lock screen. And then another very small change I noticed just as I cut that previous shot, whenever you are clicking the play pause button on the lock screen, as you can see, it animates a little bit differently compared to the previous build of iOS 16. So a very small change here uh, with the play pause button. And we also have some changes inside of the general section of settings. So when you click on software update, the wording has been moved around a bit and Apple has kind of bolded 16.0 uh, right there. So this screen looks a little bit different. And also when you go to about, as you can see here, the warranty section is now a lot bigger. So in previous builds of iOS 16, I believe this warranty section was the same width as all of these other sections, but now the warranty section in beta five is a lot bigger and easier to press on. And to me, what looks like another very small change is inside of iMessage. So to me, it looks like the animation whenever you undo an iMessage looks a little bit different to my eye. So if I press and hold on this message and click on undo send, the way that it kind of breaks apart the message bubble and explodes it looks a little bit different compared to beta four. So that's gonna do it for everything I could find new in iOS 16 beta five. I think this has to be the biggest update to iOS 16 that we've seen inside the current beta cycle. I think with Apple adding the battery percentage uh, right inside the status bar is a huge feature, uh, something that has been requested for so many years. So it's kind of weird that it made its first appearance in beta five. I don't know why Apple couldn't have uh, put this in right off the start with iOS 16, but it is nice that it is here. I just wish that it was available for for every single iPhone, because uh, as an iPhone mini user, I kind of feel left out. But uh, if you guys enjoyed this video or found it interesting and helpful, please drop a like on it. Also leave me a comment below telling me if you wanna see a follow-up video on iOS 16 beta five. My name is Michael with IDB. I'll see you next time.